Hi, my name is David Bales, Product Manager here at Pioneer Cycle Sports. In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize the screens on your CA600 cycle computer. There are two ways to customize the screens on your CA600. The first is with the Cyclosphere Control app, and the second way is just directly from the CA600 itself. Now if we're going to cu customize using the Control app, we're going to want to turn on our computers, select our CA600 from the Control app, and one of the first ways to go is just using the Setup Wizard. Now you may have already done this getting started, but you can work your way through the initial setup and go into, just keep, keep hitting next until you have the page set selection setting. And from here, we can select the default page sets. And there are six page sets preset. Page set one and are, are all titled. Uh, page set one is a basic pedaling training set for use with a Pioneer pedaling monitor system. Page set two is to use with, uh, as a power training, uh, to use with any amp plus power meter or computer, uh, uh, amp plus power meter. And page set three for heart rate. Four is designed for navigation. Five is some advanced pedaling techniques. And six is a multi-sensor, kind of an all-around page set. Uh, in this case, we'll, we can just select page set one, and this is the page set you would have. You can select this page set. Now the next way we could go, data field settings from the control app, and again we could select a page set, one through six, and there's a training preset page as well here or we can select from sample page. And in this case, we have filters. Select the layouts you want. Select any graphs you might want and change that page to any one of these samples. And probably the more common and is just to customize the data fields independently. So customize data field. We can change the layout pattern. Now, any green is going to allow a map. And this is a bit unique with our system in that we could have multiple pages with maps. So you could have more than one map page, maybe a full page map and in, and the second uh, a half map with uh, uh, maybe ride profile. So once we've selected the layout pattern, we can choose any metric we want to put in any one of those boxes. You'll also notice that you can see the data fields changing on the computer as you go to confirm the settings you've chosen. Another thing you can do is just delete a page. So if you don't want the 10 preset pages, you only want four or five, just turn off those pages. Page 10 is preset for Strava live segments. And the computer will automatically switch to that screen when you approach one of your starred Strava segments. You can customize this screen with any metrics that you want so that it can be partially Strava segment with your own metrics maybe on top as we've done with this page. Another way to go is to customize the screens um, from the CA600 itself. And it's a little bit unique in that uh, some app-based cycle computers require the app. In our case, we do not. Uh, if you don't have the app handy, you can very easily customize your screens 
uh, directly from the computer itself. Uh, just press menu, scroll over to settings, and enter. You just scroll straight up top and data fields, select, and first is your page set choices. So in this case we're on page set one, but we could change that and select any one of the six or a training page set. In this case we'll stay with page set one. Then we move down to the layout and the layout by page. So maybe we want to change page three to be this layout. We'll select that and change it. And finish up any other pages that we want to do. Go back and OK for that. Uh, layout pattern for page set one. Now we go into the data field settings. And in this case, we're on page one of page set one. And you can see that each metric is numbered. So scroll down and say we want to change metric number three. We enter. We want to change it from data category course to maybe, let's look at our gears. Front and rear. Gear position or teeth. We'll stay with gear position. And now you can see it's here uh, on metric box three on page one, gear front and rear. And that's it. It's very simple to do. You can change screen sets using the control app or directly from the CA600. Thanks for watching.